My name is Annie, and today we will read this book. Dear Fairies, this book is fair, has tiny letters inside. Now, let's read this book. Dear Fairies, I tell was having a birthday party and all her friends were coming in fancy dress. She was wearing a fairy outfit from her mom and dad. It was the best present she had ever had. They had a picnic in the garden and played all this sort of game. Everyone has a wonderful time. But at last, it was time to go home. After her friends had left, Adel helped to tiny, tiny the garden, and it was that family and letters hidden and under the strawberry. Dear Adele, we enjoy your party today. The cake looks delicious and your dress is beautiful. Love from Fairies. Such good letters. Add it again. Right? And the strawberry. Adele wrote back to fairies with a attached greeting. Dear fairies, thank you for your lovely letter. I am very excited to have a letter from fairies. Please, will you write to me again? Lots of love from Adele. In the morning, she hid her letter behind a chestnut leaf. She couldn't wait to see if the fairies would write back. Then she went look later on. There's a tiny letter behind a big snail. He must be a postman, thought Abel. Dear Adele, thank you for the little cake. It tastes just like fairy food. Love from fairies. Fairies. Adele wondered what the fairy did find to eat in the garden. Dear fairies, what do fairies eat? The fairies make a cake. My favorite is fish fingers and chips, and sometimes have pizza. Lots of love from Adele. She waited angrily for a reply. She looking out all the time to see fairies deliver it. She didn't see anyone arrive. But when she went into the garden to check, she found a lot of tiny letters and two Three doors here. Yeah. Oh, this fairy is sweeping. Oh, this fairy is have tea time. Oh, uh -oh. This fairy is smiling at we. Now let's see what the letters. Dear Dad. 
spell fairies drain raindrops and eat berries. And we also make fairy cake. We also buy nice things to eat from fairy markets. Love from the fairies. Why did you wear your pretty dress today? Fairies. I think the fairy is real. Or, um, Adele wrote back at once and hit the letter in the pea pond. Dear fairies, my fairy dress is for dressing up and parties. Mommy says I can't wear it every day. What do fairies wear? I think they must have lovely dresses. Lots of love from Adele. As she hanging out her door washing, she watched even harder that to glimpse a fairy, but a new letter arrived by the butterfly pots. Dear Adele, fairy clothes are made of butterfly wings and flower petals. Sometimes we got human clothes if we really like them. We love dressing up from love from fairies. Dressing up was Adele's favorite thing. She ran back to answer the letters. Dear fairies, I like dressing up too. I wish I could see your dresses. Do fairy have a party in the garden and play games like me? Lots of love from Adele. She glanced around the garden as she she put her next letter in a hollow tree root. The fairy could be watching her right now. And sure enough, it wasn't long before she found a red one behind them deep in the petals of a road. We have one we love wonderful moonlit parties in your garden with music and dancing. We invite all our friends. We love parties. Love parties. Oh, fairies love dancing. Fairies really like to play them. To to have a party. Okay, let's hide the rest. Hide the, um, hide this before I can can see. That girl's stuff, Peter said. Anyway, your mom wrote that there are no such thing as fairy. That's not true. Get Adele and burst to his, into tears. She turned and ran into the kitchen. Just then, Peter from next door. Just then, Peter from next door looked over the fence. Look at what I have cut. He busted proudly, holding a jar of minnows. I've got some better than that said Adele shyly, and she showed him a fairy letter. That girl's stuff, Peter said. Anyway, your mom wrote that there's no such thing as fairies. 
That's not true. Get Adele and burst into tears. She turned and ran into the kitchen. Adele cried, Mom, did you write my fairy letters? What letters? Show me, said her mom, giving her a hug. Adele, mom looked very surprised when he saw the tiny letters. Come with me, upstairs. Adele, mom took her carpet wooden chest from the water. Inside there was hundreds of tiny <laughs> It's a tiny of letters. Dear fairy these are all the letters I would have from the fairies when I was a little girl. She explained. When I grew up, I thought my mom had written them for me. But I know there's really fairies at the bottom of the garden. Ta-da! There's such... There's writing paper, a red knobs, a pencil, the fairy dust. Oh, sure. um, I was writing all of this with my mom to the fairies. And this. And I think the fairies will be because um, one day I put my fairy letters under the leaves of the rug. My mom. With me. And my mom put it too. And the next morning, I see a fairy letter. But I thought my mom got it. But in the fairy dust, it's a tiny of stones. Okay. This story is very wonderful, right? I think you'll go to sleep now. Goodbye.